Each city block in Mega City 1 has the right, if not duty, to maintain its own local defence unit. Originally, each block city defence unit was intended to be a trained group of citizens ready to assist the Justice Department against any threats both foreign and domestic. However, it has been shown that time and again that when average citizens with their usual share of grudges, grievances and paranoia have access to military grade equipment, the most mundane law enforcement situations can escalate disastrously out of hand. Originally appearing in 2080's annual of 1981 wearing their City Death printed t-shirts, however developed their iconic look in later issues and reappeared in the infamous Blockmania storyline. Despite all of the negatives, City Death Squads have fought bravely and made the ultimate sacrifice protecting the Big Meg on countless occasions, protecting millions of citizens when the Justice Department never had sufficient judges to do so. A team of City Death will be led by the squad leader and each will have a different role within that squad. Whether it be a rank and file trooper or a highly skilled marksman with a sniper rifle, City Death Squads will have access to a wide range of weapons. The main City Death set comes with the main character cards, along with the following Hit Him With Everything and Peeper's Armoury card. The reinforcement set provides the following cards, Troggies and OK Time For Plan B. Both sets are now available at warlordgames.com.